What is up, Sneak Geeks? It's your boy, Sneaker Life, back with another video. Hey, man, a bunch of unboxings. Those of you that follow your boy on Instagram, boom, at Mike the Compass, you guys saw I got a lot of packages in. So I definitely need to do some unboxings. Uh, yeah. 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 Uh. Uh. Lord, forgive me for this watch I bought. Uh, I know that shit had cost a lot Yeah And I don't really like to floss a lot But I just really feel the time is right Uh, you know, what's in the box? Unboxings are pretty popular Uh I guess based on how this video goes, you know, you guys leave, leave that thumbs up. Let me know if you enjoy the video. But I do have a few packages that I do want to unbox for you guys. So let's get into them. First, we're going to start off with the sneaker shields. So, I mean, I am honored. I love sneaker shields. A lot of people ask me tons of questions about, yo, how do you keep your shoes crease free? And, you know, Sneaker shield, you know, it's where it's at. So the thing about it is they actually just dropped a new generation. If you guys want to peep that, uh, one thing I would have to say is sneaker shields aren't for everyone. Uh, I definitely recommend trying them out to see if they are for your foot. But some people do find it very uncomfortable, and some people find it comfortable. So it really depends. When using sneaker shields, I suggest you are about a size up, just because it does take up that room of your shoe. But for me, I enjoy them. They're extremely comfortable. And, you know, just go purchase them. The link will be down below in the description. And just let me know what you think about them. Up next is something that I actually got for under retail. Cyber Monday. I am a little late on this, but I still will do a review for you guys. I know you want to see this shoe. Um, I think the biggest issue about these ones was how is the quality going to be? And, you know, I want the leather. Nothing compares to the actual shattered backboard ones. But, you know, the quality is dope. It's a nice, clean sneaker. I actually paid like 93 bucks. Again, I did post that on Instagram. Uh, just a dope shoe. I'm really glad I got it. And under retail, I can't complain. I will definitely probably rock these maybe tomorrow. I'm not necessarily sure. But it is a dope sneaker. As far as the quality goes, it's not amazing whatsoever. Uh, definitely the same quality as last year's releases. Or the last couple years, I should say, those Jordan 1 releases. Nothing really compares to the shattered backboard ones, but a definitely a clean shoe. I was so glad to cop this. Uh, I've been sleeping on the OVO stuff. I needed something to go with my J's, and they did a small little restock. Luckily, I was on Twitter at the time. A lot of you guys saw me adding it to the car. Bling, bling, bling. Hey. 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 The Air Jordan OVO hat. Uh, definitely, I got this under retail also. $40 hat, picked it up for $24. Bucks. Uh, just want to say the quality, it's like really flimsy. Like We do have the Jumpman in gold. Then on the back, OVO, October's very own. You know, I I'm, I rep a heavy with this brand. I would definitely purchase a lot more stuff. It's, it's really expensive though. I'm born in October. Those of y'all that know, been following me, you know, October's very own. Then we do have the OVO Owl and, you know, just a dope hat to add to the collection. Can't beat $24. Now, I need to make a video on this really soon, but it is the holiday times, and you know, people need cash. So, I was on Instagram looking at big feet sneaks. If you guys don't follow that, it's for usually like size 11 and a half or bigger. Found this steal, it is the LeBron 9 South Beach. You know, retail was $250 with tax, maybe $267. I ended up paying $300 shipped for these. Dude needed the money. This is the time to purchase your grails. I'm telling you, every year save up. People need the money for Christmas. People have families to feed, and you got sneakers to buy. Dead stock came with the receipt and everything. I've been waiting to pick these up. Uh, you don't even know, like I've really been waiting. They go around for about 500, 450 plus, but I mean 300 to me is a steal. I plan on rocking these when I go out to visit my boy in Florida. Just an overall dope sneaker. All I need is the big bangs, dead stock. And, you know, patience. When it comes to getting shoes, patience. You know, 
you really win at the end of the day if you keep searching and this was just one of those steals that I did pick up. But anyway, I wanted to shout all you guys out, 91,000 subscribers. I really might hit 100K by the end of Christmas. A lot of you guys keep hitting me up to bring back the vlog channel. It will be coming soon. This week I'm going to California for basketball and I'm gonna vlog the whole thing. It should be dope. Hey man, I appreciate all y'all, man. Like, y'all don't even know how much this actually means to me. It's just amazing. Come a long ways and appreciate all y'all. Add your boy on Snapchat. I just can't thank y'all enough, but I got a lot of dope content coming, so keep riding with me. This is your boy, Sneaker Life. Yee! Y'all already know. Hey man, I'll see y'all in the next video. Run it. Hands in the air now. You still here? Hey man. Hey, hey, hey. Yee yee! Hey, ooh, wee. The Yeezys. Yo, I'm telling y'all, follow me on Snapchat. I, I I couldn't end this video. I gotta tell you guys. Hey. 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 Hello? Anyway. Shout out to Kais. Uh shout out to Kais one time. Yo. Scratch these off my list. Love yours. Love yours. Love yours.